How's it gaming guys? I'm Phil the Blanks. Welcome back to Let's Play Battle Kid Fortress of Peril. Last episode we got super far in this last segment of World uh, World 4 on the first try. We're not going to make it this time I think as far as we did last time. That was a fluke. That was a major fluke. But hey, pretty cool. Eh. So, ah, well there you go. See fluke. Um, also, I don't know, I'm wondering if anyone noticed this. Question of the day, did anyone notice what I'm about to say? Last episode, so how I, um, I kind of made a mistake and clicked end and I had to go fish, oh dang it, fish for the, uh, password to kind of start up, uh, where I was. And I put the password in wrong and it gave me a, um, that was very dumb. It gave me a, a an ability that I haven't collected yet. Uh, it was the top screen there, it's the fourth ability. The good news is, is I didn't actually notice it until I was editing it, so I never used the ability. So it, it wasn't a passive ability, it was an active ability, so I actually have to actively use it. Um, it, it it's, whatever, spoilers. It, it's a double jump. I didn't realize that I had the double jump because I put in the password incorrectly. So when I, when I was about to film this episode too, I was like, why am I still having the double jump? So it turns out I, I, I typed in the password wrong. And that one small mistake gave me that uh, that uh, extra power up. So I thought that was kind of funny. Oh shit, that was bad. Oh my god. I love how the first time in this area I had this like beginner's luck and got to the second last room before the save point, before the boss. I can't believe I did that. Whatever. I mean, still a lot of the f a lot of fun of the game is just making a shit ton of mistakes. But today we'll be able to beat the boss and uh, continue on. Uh, I don't know if we'll get to World 5, but we'll get very close. So, better than nothing. Kill you. Oh shit, wow, yeah, that was very stupid. Man! I really wish I had just made it past this segment last episode, because that would have been amazing progress. Plus, to be honest, the idea of getting past, like, any segment without getting a death would have been so cool. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, that was not. Because, like, that was my best chance to do it. I don't think I'll ever be able to do that again. That was just unprobable. Improbable. My mistake. English is not my first language. It's just the language I speak all the time. That's all. There we go. Okay, cool. Uh, this one's fairly easy. I say that, but I've been dying like crazy lately, so. Nope, that was dumb. Ah, oh, screw it. <laughs> Still do it. Cool. This is where I think I left. Nope, I had done this room. I think it's the next room that I didn't do properly. Oh, just made it. It's this one right here. Okay. Nope. Nope. Nope, come on, man. Jump the whole way. No, that didn't work. Oh, shit. Ugh. Nope. Oh, come on, the stupid frogs, man. They're incessant. Okay, there we go. Much better off for you. Ooh. Actually, surprised I made that. It is nice that once you figure out a room, it does get a little easier. Like, if it's a room that, like, with the, the toads, for example, or a lot of it's, like, figuring out what do I need to do to get past this room. And once you do it, you're like, alright, cool, that's not too bad. Uh, I don't think I got this. Oh, okay. Okay. No, come on. You need to... Drop on me, man. No! Stupid frogs. I hate the red thing. If it wasn't for the red thing, that'd be an actually weirdly easy room. I think that's why, probably why I that added it. Oh, other thing. The first, I believe it was the first episode, or at least the set, maybe the first second episode. I was talking about how Sidak was like the one guy who made this game. That's not technically true. He did all the programming, and I guess he did all the music too, and most of the art, but he did get help from some people with certain things, like certain sprites and stuff. So I just wanted to kind of correct myself. It's not very fair of me to be like, this one guy did it, and then like not acknowledge any of his of like the people that helped him. So just wanted to point that out there. Once we beat the game, because I'm totally gonna beat this game, uh, hopefully, we'll. Eh. Oh, okay, we'll um, see the staff credits anyways. So, ah, shit! Oh my god, this might be the room that like just destroys me for a while. There's only one room after that, too, so... And then it's another good old save point. And our next ability, too. Frig, yeah, that was... That felt bad. Okay. 
I'm also trying to, like, go faster, which is, like, not always the smartest thing to do. Alright, good. At least these two rooms right here are, like, super easy. And this one. I'm surprised I haven't messed up in this room yet, to be really honest. Oh, wow. Okay. Gotta really figure out what I'm supposed to be doing here. There we go. No, how- Oh my god, I hit the fucking ceiling. Mm -hmm. Oh, Phil. I hate when, like, I'm doing so good, and then, like, I immediately just get another wall. You know what I mean? Like, but I don't get to save any of the progress that I made. Yeah, I'm screwed. Holy shit. That is frustrating. It's like, we should be fighting the boss right now. It's really, really annoying me. I kind of wish I didn't do that well, because it gave me, like, high hopes, and... Ah, oh, high hopes are the friggin' worst. And they come crashing down. Sort of just wish there was one small save point in the middle of all... How, why did I jump into that? And I think I'm at that point, too, where I'm getting really frustrated myself, so I think my play is just gonna get worse. And that's not cool. Okay. I want to skip these two rooms, too. I haven't died in them yet. It's just given me. <laughs> well, all it takes is one wrong move, and then bam, there's a death. Okay. Figure this out. Go the way I wanted. Frig, I could have just hugged the wall. The worst part is, too, it goes so fast that my brain can't compute what I'm supposed to do, even though I know what I'm supposed to do, in the sense that, like, if I hugged that wall, that toad wouldn't have gotten me, and I know that, but because it happens so fast, my brain can't figure out that I'm supposed to do that. And my, you know, my fingers certain, or my thumbs, I guess, certainly can't figure it out in time. Oh my god, really? Well, there you go. One death in that room. Oh, that was actually really close. Holy shit. I'm surprised I made that. Nope. Okay, good. This is it. This is the time. Ugh, really? Yikes. Come on, I'm I'm eight minutes in this. This is ridiculous. Part of me is too, like, it doesn't help that I'm, tr I'm trying to go faster than normal, and that's probably not good for me right now. Okay. I got this. Because I know what to do now. Good. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. Last room. Ugh. Yes! Oh, man. Alright, I'm feeling good now. Feeling good. There we go. So, our next ability. We infinite oxygen obtained. Breathe freely underwater. Save. Time for a boss. Oh, my God. Alright. I remember this one not being as hard as... Oh, the, the color mancer by the, her, by the name. Her name was Cleo. I don't know why that's important, but... There you go. Oh, God. <laughs> Alright. So, learning patterns. Learning patterns. Boss is, I believe, three moves. And that's that bubble thing. Okay. Okay. And then that thing. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. So that's not how to avoid that. <laughs> Looks like I gotta stay up near the top a lot. So let's do that. It also doesn't look like there's any randomness compared to uh, Cleo. So that's good. Shit. Okay. I gotta get way back in the air before that shot goes off. We can do this. Done everything else up until this point. Okay, avoid those. Get up there. Yeah. Oh, okay, I gotta get up there a little bit. Not that fast. <laughs> you get that timing right. Once I survive one like full wave, then that like teaches me how to do it. So there's no randomness. So that's 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 my saving grace right now. Oh, and then I got back up there again, but the water physics, man. 
Water physics mean I don't fall as fast. So I sh probably shouldn't be doing my feather fall. I think I only should shoot three times too. Ugh. Ah, damn it. Oh, that worked. Can I just go down here and, like, be safe? Oh, I can, but, like, the bubbles are still down there, so it's not really a safe area. Plus, I do need to jump to, sh uh, to shoot at them, so I should probably be doing that regardless. Jump over. Oh, he's invincible during that. I did not know that. Oh, well, the, it seems like I got the... Well, not the pattern yet. Getting there, though. This seems like one of those, like, once you learn the pattern, you are good. You are good. Roar. I know. Roar, roar, roar. Oh, my God. Damn it. Freaking bubbles. Bubbles are not my friend. At all. Roar all you want. Oh, his mouth needs to be open. I get it. Okay. There we go. Oh, damn it. Well, I gotta also hit him. Okay, this isn't too bad. Maybe I gotta aim a little bit better. Alright. Nice, nice. He's gonna start going faster, isn't he? Nice, doing much better. Ah, oh, I think I'm a little higher too. Like that. Oh, getting there. Is this it? We're gonna do it? Okay. Yeah, this isn't too hard actually. Just like a very intense Mega Man boss. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Cool. All right. Definitely gonna go back and save, though. Yay, victory fanfare. Battle Kid looks like he does not care. So like, I guess I did it. I don't really care. Back up we go. Nope. Back up we go. Ah. There we go. All right. Perfect. Let's continue. So now we can go underwater. So obviously, because of the last episode, you saw the big maze we, we had. That's clearly where we're supposed to go next. But now we can just... Go back, we actually have to fall down the waterfall, so it's a little bit different. I mean, most of it you just skip because you do this, you know? So this is not too bad. Skip that. Uh, skip that. Oh, watch out for frog. Lead you away, there we go. And bottom of the waterfall. But instead of going to the left, we have to go to the right. So this is kind of the next little, almost like a fourth segment, I guess. Eh. Eh. Okay, good. Not too bad. What is here? Oh. Okay, the robots. Ah, damn it. Well, at least you just start, like, up here. To be honest, a lot of this is just be annoying because it's a lot of traveling with no problems, so... That's a little annoying, but... It could be a lot worse than this. Being... Oh, I guess I could save down here. Yeah, let's save here just in case. Go even further. I think I can save... Wait, no, not here. Okay, Oof. Down, frogs, careful frogs. Nope, nope, come here. There we go. Alright. Try this again. It's not be crazy. I can't I can't imagine being like that crazy, because you know. We've already beaten the level, so I'm not giving us something too nuts. Ah, oh, frick, the robot. I hate the robot so much. The way they follow you is not okay. It's creepy. I don't like it. for me. It's the thing that follow me that I don't like in these types of games, because they follow you fast, man. Like, they're really in your face. That was just epically dumb. Oops. Down, down, right. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Frog. Down. Just going through the motions now. Yes, there we go. Oh my god. 
Well, not smooth, but I'll take it. Ooh, I don't like this at all. Oh, God, okay. Oh, oh! Damn it, that was so close. I think that's the last one, too, because, like, again, I don't think it's a very long area. It's more like it's just there to piss me off. Plus, to be honest, in terms of game design, I like the idea of going back down the waterfall. It's something I would have done. I, I've always liked ideas of, like, waterfalls and verticality in games. So, I love the idea of climbing up a waterfall only to have to come back down as a different... Frig, come on, Phil. As a different challenge, so... Ah! <laughs> Alright, that was funny. That was funny. I guess. Maybe you wasn't. <laughs> Oof. This is not a lot of progress we made this episode, which is kind of bullshit, really, because... Like, that... I'm, I apologize for, like, the first half of this episode just because I'm, I'm so surprised that, that took me so long to do. But, whatever. I guess that's the problem with having high standards at the beginning of the episode, because you think you're going to do really good. I didn't even see that hit me. I'd really like to at least make it out of this level and start towards level 6 before we ended, to be honest. Just just so I can placate like my own feelings on, like, you know, making progress. So who knows, steps up might go a little bit long just because of that. Ugh, I hate this. Because I'm like, I'm always worried. Am I holding the up button properly? Oh, okay, phew. Alright. We got this. Okay, good. Please be it. Uh. Okay, that's not too difficult. Alright, cool. That helps me. That helps me. Oh, is there a save point right here? No. Oh, God. Okay, good. That's not too bad. Oh. Shouldn't have worried me as much as it did, but whatever. Oh, we have here. Oh, God. Oh. I've been so pissed if I died there. Save, 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 save. Thank you. There's also teleportation. I probably should be teleporting. I think? I don't even know where I am. Yeah, I think we're supposed to teleport. So yeah, Teleporter 2 was the correct way to go. It looks like I'm supposed to just go all the way down here. The whole point is I'm supposed to be going towards water. So that's what we're supposed to be doing. So careful. Because now that we can breathe underwater, it just makes sense to go underwater. I'm like, yeah, okay, that makes sense. So let's head down here. Oh, oh that was really, 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 really close. Careful the clam. And yes, I know this episode is going to go a little bit longer. I'm not exactly sure how much longer. I've turned off my timer at this point. Because I was just wandering around for a little while. But I figured we'll get the second key. And that'll be uh, enough for the episode. So, Because I still want to make a certain amount of progress per episode, of course. There we go. Save point. And there we go. Okay, cool. So right here. So we saw this before. And we, we joked about it. I went down here for a little bit. But you do not have enough air at all in order to do all this is this uh this is the biggest friggin troll like in the game because it's like not about death it's just about boredom it's just tedious so around we go uh please don't die <laughs> also to be honest if i was timmy this would probably be melly's favorite area i mean at least i can breathe underwater so it wouldn't be a big deal but like i hate water i hate swimming i hate this type of stuff Ugh. So this would be like endless caverns that just barely, you know, enough for me to go through because of my like height or whatever. I would just hate that. And Timmy dies in one hit too, so he's like, he's gotta be extra careful. Yeah. So this is this is just this whole area it is just this, believe it or not. Even in his own commentary, Sivak was like, "Yeah, I probably shouldn't have made this." It's just I get why he did. It's it's a way to keep players from skipping something and you need to be able to breathe underwater in order to uh, get to it. So this is the only way he could make sure no one's going fast enough to get to a place because it is actually impossible to do this. Oh my gosh. So long. Way to pat out my episode though. Hooray. My goodness. My goodness. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> Even here you gotta backtrack. What a dick. 
I think that's the last one. I think the next screen is... There we go. Perfect. With key two, we'll be able to figure out where to go next for level five. I am Film the Blanks, and I will see you guys next level. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this episode, click that subscribe button and hit the bell icon to know when the next episode is up. If you want to support my channel, share some videos with some friends and consider supporting me on Patreon.